A century of faith and education. A Cleveland pre-K through 8 school is celebrating its 100th year open. And while several Catholic schools in Cleveland were forced to shut its doors due to decreased enrollment, St. Jerome's withstood the test of time. The News 5's Jesse Schultz stopped by today and takes us inside. St. Jerome has been a staple in Cleveland's Collinwood neighborhood for 100 years now. And while leaders are so proud of their past, they are focused on keeping it a part of the neighborhood's future. It was the 1922 to 23 school year. The world looked a lot different than it does now. But one thing stands as it did all of those years ago the St. Jerome School off of Lakeshore Boulevard in North Collinwood. This is the original building. For 100 years, these halls have echoed with sounds of children, church, and curriculum. You don't even see businesses open for 100 years anymore. I want to cry all the time when I think about it. Susan Cohen is the principal of St. Jerome, but she says their guiding principle of community have kept these doors open. I tried to make it more like a home for these children. You know, they come here, they feel relaxed, they do their work, and they feel safe when they're in our building. Can you find any sight words? Because while the outside world has gotten more chaotic over the years, I can't read. You gotta got learn your sight words. St. Jerome has remained that safe place. We try our best to make their day as easy as it can be, so they're not thinking about those other issues that they may have at home. I think that there's still a need for faith-based education. Susan Biggs of the Catholic Diocese of Cleveland says low numbers forced many other schools to close. St. Jerome is now the only Catholic school in the Collinwood neighborhood. You look at the data and the data showing like families are leaving. The families are leaving the church. They're leaving our schools. Are you done? And it has done what so many other private schools could not do, grow enrollment. They still have, you know, a great steady enrollment for the last, you know, five, six years. They've been over 200, which is great for our urban education. Thank you. It continues to attract new students. My mom just wanted me to like, get better in school. It's working really well. Oh my goodness, you could read that? And keeps generations of families coming back too. I feel like I've gotten better academically and the teachers have helped me grow and I will take all the stuff that they told me to high school with me. The barbars are elephants. Cohen is confident their century old teachings of faith and love will continue to carry them into the next one. I probably won't be here 100 more years, but for sure another 100 years. We can do it because they're so dedicated. Reporting in Cleveland, Jesse Schultz, News 5. Some sharp kids there. The Catholic Diocese of Cleveland says enrollment got a boost from the pandemic since Catholic schools returned to in-person learning sooner than others. In Rob Court, the diocese says enrollment has continued to grow since then.